Oh my God, I've got so many things to tell you now about how microdosing magic mushrooms has totally changed my outlook on holidays and meeting up with family, etc. Let's take it away right now. <music> Hey there, how are you? Dr. Dave, welcome back to Microdose You. I really appreciate you. Let's get right into this. So I want to set the stage for the past, I'd say several decades. I mean decades. I've had a really tough time, and a lot of people really didn't know this, but I had a really tough time um, getting together with um, family members, large gatherings with family for holidays, um, et cetera. Um, Going way back, there was somebody that I was um, associated with. Let's just leave it at that. We're not gonna, I don't wanna put anybody under, throw anybody under the bus, but there was somebody that I was very closely associated with that really tried to break up my relationship with some of the people that I was closest with in my family. And there was just a really horrible phase of my life that I was able to luckily get out of. But then from there, for some reason, family gatherings were always very difficult for me. Uh, there were a lot of people, people talking. Um, some people were giving me negative energy. Um, there was just a lot that went into the family gatherings that became very tough. And I really never talked to many people about this at all, but I just tried my best to either kind of stay quiet or sometimes even stay away from family gatherings. They just weren't fun for me. And this goes even up until um, very, very recently. I tried not to be involved as much as possible. Um, when we, since we live in Utah now and a lot of our family is back east, that meant maybe not even traveling back to family gatherings for holidays. And, and um, COVID actually, is, as bad as COVID is and was, um, it actually helped me a little bit because it gave me a good excuse not to have to get together with people. And that was really, really bad because my family is a group of people that I really do love and um, they're, they're good people. And I've just, you, you know, had a difficult time. And I'm going to say it was me. It was, it was my mindset. It was things that were going on in my life um, mentally and more. But it, it was just a really, really tough time for me. Now, fast forward, um, I've been microdosing magic mushrooms for over a year and a half now. And due to COVID, um, this trip that I just took back east with my wife to visit family members for Thanksgiving, uh, and we're in 2022 now as I, as I record this, um, this was perhaps the best time I have ever had with my family for as long as I can remember. And I want to tell you something, I owe it 100% to the magic mushrooms, to this miracle plant medicine, psilocybin. It has totally rewired my brain. And um, going from somebody from the past who dreaded family functions, who tried to stay away, who became anxious and somewhat depressed when a family function or a holiday was about to take place, I, this time, embraced it. Um, we were back east for about, how many days? About five, six days, something like that. And I will tell you that every single interaction I had with family members was nothing short of beautiful and I would say phenomenal. Every single chance we had to meet up with family. And there were a lot of chances, either small little gatherings, um, or large gatherings with, with my mom and, and all my brothers and um, their kids and all of our, and my kids and grandkids. And it was just something that made me feel so good and something that I could not have really dealt with in the past. And so you might say, well, Dave, was it really the magic mushrooms? How do you know it was the magic mushrooms? Well, I'll tell you because I've done a lot of things to improve my health over the past couple of years, a lot. Uh, getting better sleep, being treated for uh, sleep apnea, uh, going off of my vegan diet and, and, and 
bringing um, animal products back into my diet and, and into my nutrition, which definitely made me feel a lot better. However, the major thing I can tell you for sure that has changed my mindset and my mind and the way I feel every single day and uh, and my, my, my uh, I guess my, I, I'm going to say my serotonin levels because as I'm recording this right now, I just feel really, really good. I just feel like there's something going on that has made me feel like I should have been feeling for the past many, many decades and had not. Um, it, it is clearly, clearly the um, psilocybin that has absolutely rewired my brain and I now look at people with uh, at, at, with kindness, with understanding, with appreciation. And I think I hadn't done a lot of that in the past many, many years. I think I might have been um, more judgmental, uh, didn't have patience for other people as much as I do now, um, not as loving, um, not as caring. Um, and I could, I could probably keep going on and on and on. I just was kind of like doing my own thing and didn't, didn't care as much as I probably should have about other people and especially about people in my family. But now I see things in a totally different way. I mean, of course I am dealing with my own mortality being in my later sixties now, you know, I know that I don't have as many years left as I did when I was in my thirties or forties. And that's, you know, anybody's going to be like that, but I think I'm dealing with it better and on a completely different level now, because not only do I feel really good mentally and physically, but that allows me to see other people in a different light and in a much more positive light. And um, again, there's, there's really nothing that could have done this besides the magic mushrooms, the microdosing of the magic mushrooms. Nothing else could have changed my thought process and changed my brain and changed, and, and changed the way I see things and see, changed the way I, I feel about other people than this. So um, I, I want to just make it clear that, that as, as, good as I think I've been doing on um, microdosing magic mushrooms, this past holiday traveling back east has confirmed more than I ever knew. I mean, I was actually going into this trip thinking that, oh, it's going to be, it might be difficult. It's, you know, I'm not sure how it's going to be. But once we got there and once we started interacting with friends and family members, mainly family members, I didn't, I don't even think I saw a bunch of friends, but it's mainly family members. Um, it just was uh, nothing short of amazing, and I want to say a miracle, but a miracle could be the plant medicine that, that has done the work for me. Um, if you are in this situation, as far as um, just not feeling good about being with others and try to stay away and social anxiety, and that I definitely had social anxiety. There's there's no question about it. I'm not wanting to be with the people that you love or supposedly love, not wanting to be in groups with them and hanging out is, is definitely a level of a form of social anxiety. There's, there's no question about it. But I feel that I'm just on a different playing field. And I just want to tell you, if your experience anything even remotely close to what I had been experiencing for, like I said, decades, decades of not feeling good with others. Um, I'm telling you there is a road ahead of you that is going to be more positive and better than you ever, than you could ever imagine that you ever thought. Another thing that I have totally gotten over and I owe it to the, I owe it to the mushrooms for sure is that in the past, um, certain people would try to monopolize and dictate and, and um, schedule other family members of ours. So maybe my wife and I would not feel like we could see them as much as we wanted to because they were being kind of drawn to other people, and if that makes sense at all, and kind of controlled by other people's schedules. But that feeling is, is totally gone. My feeling now is let everybody have their share, let everybody have their fun, let everybody do what they want to do. And when my family and kids and grandkids and everybody are with us, 
Uh, we make the most of it. I don't care what they've been doing otherwise, how much time they've spent with other people. But when they're with us and when we're all together, it just there's nothing more important and nothing that means more than the world to me than, than being with them. And again, it's just reshaped the way I think. So I hope this makes sense. I hope you understand what I'm saying. And I hope that not only um, sharing my story with you, but I hope if you're, again, if your story is, is um, remotely similar with trying to being the one that stays away and having anxiety for the holidays around the holidays and not wanting the holidays to take place because you just don't know what's going to come up with family members. Well, I was once there and that feeling is totally gone. And I know that um, if you do utilize the mushrooms in the way that I teach and the way I share with them, that I have, I, I know for sure, I am very confident in my mind that you will feel the same way that I feel now. We got back yesterday. Um, the flights were crazy. You had to get up like three in the morning Eastern time, which would translate to 1 a.m. Uh, mountain time where I am right now. And so my, my uh, time clock, my circadian rhythms have been like totally, totally screwed with. But I'm sitting here in my home today here in Salt Lake City and just um, thinking back about the time that we spent with family over the past week and how great it was and how I want to thank this wonderful plant medicine for um, making my life the way it should have been over the past um, many, many years. Um, so that's really what I wanted to say today. And, and I want to thank you for taking the time to to uh, listen and uh, if you're watching the video portion, watch this. And if you are so inclined, if you wanna help my channel at all, if you could just go on and give me a little rating or review, um, every little thing is appreciated because again, the more ratings and reviews I have, um, the more people will get to see this and the more people all over the world I would be able to help. Uh, that's all I'm doing this for. Uh, it's changed my life so much, I just want if I could help one or two or three other people, uh, but I'm sure I could help a lot more than that, uh, change their lives, then it would make me feel so good. So thanks again for being with me. I've got a lot more coming to you. Uh, Dr. Dave, microdose you. Bless you.